Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. We bring you the latest news from Maine to California, from our Canadian border to way down deep in the heart of Texas. Hunting season opens in the Rocky Mountains. Here is the champion moose hunter thwacking down his prey. To lure the moose to him, the hunter uses a moose call. He reaches around for it, he puts it to his lips, he blows. <laughs> have always had trouble with little boys who won't sit still to get their hair clipped. Capistrano, what's the matter for you? But now, there was a new invention. Which its inventor hopes will solve this problem. All it done. Next, please. People who eat in West once are always afraid of having their hats and coats stolen while they are eating. Here is a man who has figured out a new gadget that will allow him to eat his dinner and keep his eye on his hat at the same time. A portable rear view mirror. And so, after a hearty meal, <laughs> I'm too smart for him, <laughs> ain't I? <laughs> we are very fortunate to have the privilege of peeking in on a scientific laboratory where they are experimenting to find the secrets of life. And now, before your very eyes, you will see how rabbits multiply. In many eastern states, the summer night is whitened by twinkling whites of thousands of little fireflies. Here we see them with their whites all wit up. Hey, fireflies, where are your whites? Quiet! We're, We're having a blackout. See? And now we take you into the studio of the famous artist, Frank Putty, the creator of the popular Putty Girls. He is seen making a painting of a real live artist model. <laughs> One of the secrets of his success is the great pains that he uses to get the proportions just right. Oh, Mr. Putty, we would sure like to see your latest painting. <laughs> we all right. As we all know, ducks love to swim in the water from the day that they are born. This proud papa duck is taking his newborn widow duck wings down to the pond for their first dip. You're a chicken. Chickens can't swim. Now he tells me. Because of increased auto traffic, new safety signs are being put up all over the country. In the north, and across the Mason-Dixon line in the south. One of the best known stories about George Washington is the one of his flowing a silver dollar across the Potomac River. The famous baseball pitcher, Carl Bubble, is now standing on the historic spot and is going to prove that practically anyone can flow a dollar across this river. Are you ready, Mr. Bubble? these days, does it, folks? Your wife. Here we see the start of the first fox hunt of the new season. The lead dog is wet out first to pick up the scent 
and direct the others to the location of the Whittle Wed Fox. And there they go. <laughs> What's the trouble? Those dogs seem confused. I wonder where that lead dog went to. Give me a kiss, or I'll tell them where you are. <laughs> Here are the plans for a great big new department store to be built on this very lot. Here was the owner and the contractor. The plans are approved. They shake hands. And the building of a store will start immediately. Our mighty Navy keeps up its constant patrol of the seas through all kinds of weather. And here's the USS Connecticut. And here comes the USS Mississippi. And now the USS California. That's all, folks.